third question, SQL based question, write the SQL query for the following question based on the given employee table. So I prepared the question based on this table. What are the possibility of the question also I have added here, okay. Just look into this. The first question if you are taking, develop the table with the above field. So instead of creating the table, if they mention develop the table, you have to mention creating of the table also, insert the record also. So how do you create a table? You have to mention here create as a keyword. So create table and table name. So table name you have to look into the question. If they are mentioning given employee table, which means you have to take employee as a table name. Sometimes in the question they won't give. If they are not giving, you can only write the table name on your own is it clear after that create table employee you have to start with the bracket look into this column emp id write the same thing here and what are the values it is holding it is a it is holding the only the numbers so you have to mention number of three so this three you can mention four five six any number not a problem don't mention 100 or 200 just limit yourself with 10 only then comma after that, what is the second column? Name. So, name, same thing, you can write it. You can see here, all are alphabetic. So, you have to mention here, where care 2 of 10 I am giving. So, here we are having only 3 characters. But you can give maximum 10 or 12 or 25. Then, comma. Then, what is the next one? Age column. So, you have to mention the same thing, age. And what are the data here? Number. So, number of 2 I have mentioned here. Comma. Then, salary, number of 10. And you have to remember, finally you should close with two brackets and put the semicolon. So this is the query for creating a table. So as I told you, develop means you have to mention what? Create as well as insert. Okay, the second question is insert the records into the table. So insert into, what is the table name we have created? Employee. Employee values. Make sure that you have to write it in plural form. So insert into table name and values and open the bracket you have to look into the table so what is the first number employee id is 101 so you have to mention here 101 and next name a triple a then 35 and you can see here wherever i have mentioned string you have to mention with the single quote then comma then next value is age then salary so three records are given in the question you have to mention the three records here. Everyone is clear? How do you insert the table? So just remember, if they are asking create the table, you just create only the table. If they ask develop the table means you have to mention create a table and insert the record. Now what is the third query? Display the structure. Structure. What is the meaning of structure means? You have to mention DESC and table name. Clear? And fourth question, find total number of employees. Here they have mentioned how many employees are there in the table. So what you are supposed to do? Select count of star. Count of star means you are counting all the data in the table. So count of star from this is the table name. Is it clear? Select count of star from employee. Instead of total number, they may ask count the number of employees. So both same question. Total also Count also. You have to write the same answer. What is the next question? Find, Find the, sum the sum of employees. All employee here. salary sum means select employee salary sum means of salary from employee. Which means you are going to add all the salary and tell me the aggregate of the salary. Question display all employee. Here mention all employee records with age greater than 15 so here they have given the condition here age should be greater than 15 and whoever the employees are there in the table they should be greater than 15 and all the record you should take it from the table so whenever they have mentioned all you have to mention select star from table name employee is my table name where age is greater than or equal to 15 this one you can take it from here only the next one to find the highest salary. Highest means what? Maximum. So you have to mention select max of salary from employee. Employee is my table name. 
This next one, sort. What is the meaning of sort? Means sorting into ascending or descending order. So sort the table on salary field. What they are asking? You have to sort the data in the salary field. So select star from employee order by. Order by means you are mentioning order by salary. If they are asking or uh, on name means you have to mention here by name. Next one to modify the table and add a new column DA. Which what is it meaning? To modify the table means you are going to add new more column to the existing table. So what is the command for that? Whenever they are mentioning modify or adding the new column means you have to mention alter command. Alter table and your table name is employee add add and all directly you are mentioning here from the question and what you are going to add da they have mentioned here so da always it will be in the floating point so floating point means decimal point so number of 5 comma 2 you can mention is it clear then you have to do with double bracket with the semicolon next how are you going to calculate so calculate da as 45 percentage of the basic salary so how are we going to calculate now they have mentioned 45 percentage and they are mentioning calculate calculate means what you are going to do update update employee set da equal to 45 percentage means 0.45 into salary okay then semicolon next next question delete employees so delete employees who reached the age of 35 years again they are giving the condition here so what you have to do delete employee means delete from table name and condition whenever the condition comes you have to mention where class where age is greater than or equal to 35 if they are asking delete all records which means they are didn't give any condition here so what you are supposed to do delete from employee after that remove the table remove the table means you are going to completely remove the table from the database so for that you have to use drop so drop table employee so i have covered almost what are the possible questions from the employee i have covered all this if you have any doubt put your question in the description box thank you all